Andrew Storer, I'm the Chief Executive Officer of the Nuclear Advanced Manufacturing Research Centre, which is part of the University of Sheffield. I think for net zero for 2050, we need a mix of energy source. So we've got wind, solar, other sources of renewables. Nuclear's got a part to play. 20% um, of our electricity today, circa 20% comes from uh, nuclear power. So as we expect more energy needs going forwards in the future towards 2050, I think it stands to reason we need to at least replace that 20%, um, which is around 10, 10 gigawatts, 15 reactors. They'll go out of service by 2030. We need to replace those. And then as energy needs go up, we'll, uh, we'll need to grow. So I think nuclear's got a real, real part to play. So innovation in the supply chain is uh, really important. We've got to compete on a global footing. Um, price isn't the only factor there. We've got to be technologically uh, advanced. So innovation, whether it's manufacturing innovation or, or process, project management, planning, commercial innovation, all of those will go in to help UK companies win. Win in domestic market, but also then obviously help us win internationally. Well, I think the future looks bright, first of all. Um, uh, bright because we've got now a nuclear sector deal. We've had, that was 12 months ago, but we've been working with government, industry and government together on the nuclear sector deal. So we've now got uh, Hinkley Point really progressing now in the southwest uh, and really, uh, the rest of the UK looks to the Southwest now for the model uh, for both EDF delivery at Hinkley, but also the supply chain model that's being created in the Southwest. I think the future of the Southwest, um, it, it transitions from the build, which is still ongoing, of course, and will be for a few years to come for Hinkley, uh, but then transition into operation. I think it's important, therefore, that the Southwest recognises that opportunity <clears throat> as much as it has done for the new build opportunity. The skills that's been developed for develop, uh, delivering the, the reactor plants, the power stations, they will transfer, they should transfer into the operational phase. Let's not forget that's a, that's a long, that's decades of operation. Um, the model that's been developed in the southwest, whether it's the, the uh, larder, the, the housing, the, the hotel industries, the, the catering industries, and the technical aspects, you know, the, the, the materials, the products that's been produced in the southwest and surrounding regions. Um, that's been really important. Other regions have recognised that. So, heart of the southwest is now seen as an example for others to follow.